where we are. Carpe diem. Come on in then, we've only got a few minutes. Tell you what, quickly, prints on wood. Oh my gosh, they're absolutely gorgeous and water resistant, light fast, wipeable for the kitchen. Um, and it carries on, it carries on. We've got lovely canvases. Um, right, naked bike ride. This is Mr. Mustard when he did the naked bike ride this summer. We've got um, the lovely. Um, 2016 calendar. It's, uh, I think it's the best yet, actually. That's just me. Oranges. Oh, we've got uh, my lovely friend Jo Ram. Uh, she makes all these kitchen textiles and beautiful um, paintings. You can find her on the Solomon Gray. uk. Yeah, these are the cushions by Carolyn Brand. They used to be 20 here, but now. Oh, yes. Okay, there you go. That's lovely. <laughs> oh, and the jig dolls, of course. The jig dolls. We love these. And I've actually painted some of my own, um, which are on the back wall. I actually painted these myself. David from the Isle of Arran, he actually makes them for us. And uh, these ones, it took me ages to make these hats. I made little felt hats for them. But they're all different. And these ones, I am uh, selling, well, really I did them for the, um, well, to go with my lovely stripy Christmas tree. But these, um, if anyone wanted to buy them, they'd be £75. Pounds. I'd make that up to £100. Pounds. And then, um, the government will give another hundred pounds and I'm sending that to Sight Savers. Four hundred pounds can help end trachoma in a school in Kenya for good. So one of these dolls, selling one of these dolls would raise two hundred pounds, two of them four hundred pounds, and we could be doing our bit. <laughs> Who's done that? <laughs> and this is little Doris Puppet. <laughs> And she'll be appearing in the uh, she'll be appearing in the uh, show later on, isn't she, Adan? <laughs> and then the lovely cage stuff, Katie, katiefrolich.com. She has uh, made these uh, great little nut trees, little nut trees for Christmas. And uh, there's a little partridge in the pear tree. We have here as well. Um, this this one is mine. Um, but. Uh, there are two more in the addition to order. These are um, my bronzes. I'm going to do some more next year. Uh, really looking forward to doing that. Um, but at the moment, there was an issue of 11 with three artist proofs, and we're on to the last two artist proofs. <laughs> I spent a lovely uh, day, actually, folding up the um, tea towels and the aprons and putting little jingly bells on them. That's, that's, that's my favourite kind of thing, actually. You can get these on Mustard Shop. Look at that. Feel the quality. Feel the quality. This is Oh, I've got the You know what? Tell us what you've got. And obviously the calendar. That's me. We've got a little mug. We've got some lovely cards. And I had to have these because it says breakfast in bed for you, dear wifey, and that's what my hubby does yeah. every day. <laughs> We're going to carve into this limestone using a hammer and a chisel, which is the way the Romans did it. And you're carving V cut letters, these are quite cool Roman letters. <laughs> I've just actually signed you something, of nice, Stefan, Ken, anniversary. This is Ken. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got to get ready for my um, puppet show. Now, she is what I call a stranger to a bathtub. She wouldn't know a bar of soap if it hit her right in the head. Break on through to the other side. Break on through to the other side. Break on through. Break on through. Break on through. What happens to Mr. Mustard? You're going to have to come back next year, folks. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, fans. Happy Christmas. Christmas. Uh, Yourself a 
merry little Christmas Let your heart be light Next year all our troubles will be out of sight